Good morning folks, welcome back to the channel again. Keith here from Commander Hoop Celtic. If this is your first time viewing the channel, please hit that subscribe button below. Helps the channel grow. Thumbs up in the video or comment below anytime would be fantastic. I'm here to talk about Matt O'Reilly. Now the transfer window closes tomorrow night. He spoke over the weekend to a Danish outlet saying that he's enjoying his time at Celtic. He's focused on Champions League football and he's enjoying Glasgow. Now the last 24 hours has been a lot of talk from Manchester United Twitter pages and Manchester United fans about Matt O'Reilly. There's even talks of Scott McTominay coming this way and then Matt O'Reilly going that way. Now, reportedly, the fee that they were weighing up before this Scott McTominay loan or swap option was even available was 15 to 20 million. He's 21 years of age. His contract is still May 2026. He's a vital part of our team. You're seeing how how well he's playing even against Dundee United the other day was outstanding. He's going to go nowhere. I think a lot of Celtic fans need to realise that if he does go, it has to be a reasonable good, good amount of money for him to go. I don't think he will go anywhere till at least the end of the season. So these Manchester United fans that think that, you know, they're deluded in their head, they're spending over 100 odd million on players. What are they thinking? What are they absolutely thinking? They're not the club they once were. I think it's just desperation at this time. I know Ross Barkley is now a free agent. Celtic have inquired about him two weeks ago and I don't even think that's happened. We have obviously got said as Ivanovic in and he can play in that number eight position as well. So I can't see Matt O'Reilly going anywhere. I think the Manchester United pages, the Arsenal pages need to calm the fuck. Honestly, they need to calm down because they may have the, the, the nice stadium, which we have a nice stadium. They may have the superior wage bill, but at the end of the day, one the difference between Manchester United fans and Celtic fans is the Celtic fans idolise Matt O'Reilly. If he goes down there and they're not getting the results, it's just going to be absolutely slated. It's English Premier League, come on. It's a tourist league these days. You know, I'd rather pay, play in a farmer league and get idolised and play some Champions League football as well than go down there collecting the, collecting the wage. The grass isn't always greener. On the other side as well. So just to elaborate, Matt O'Reilly is going nowhere. This speculation of Scott McTominay, I wouldn't touch him. I think Scott McTominay is a liability. He's not great. The, maybe three years ago I thought he was outstanding, but not now. He's, his form is absolutely poor. So speeches all soon. Take care.